Some Chinese teams have traveled to the rural regions of the island nation of Madagascar off Africa to build infrastructure and improve the local inhabitants' standard of living. This, as up to 80 percent of Madagascans live in poverty, with many lacking access to clean water and proper health care. Timothy Lee tells us more. Madagascar may be surrounded by ocean, but fresh water is not always easy to come by. The island nation suffers from a shortage of water facilities and is frequently plagued by famine and drought. Here in Toliara, on the west coast of the country, locals used to retrieve water daily from a well located far away from their homes, sometimes having to travel more than 20 kilometers a day just to fetch water. But the situation took a turn for the better after a Chinese company began setting up water facilities, including water pipes and over 200 water supply systems in the country starting from 2021. Clean water is now more accessible to more than 70,000 people, or around half of the local population. Xu Jiangmin, the deputy manager of the Chinese company, said his firm was also involved in other projects in Madagascar, such as the construction of highways and repairing bridges. He believes that the building of water facilities is more meaningful because it helps alleviate problems related to the lack of clean water. Besides providing on-the-ground help, China has also deployed a special naval vessel, Peace Ark, with medical supplies and army medics to the island's shores. The ship functions as a mobile hospital, providing free medical consultation services in the northern city of Antiranana. Facilities on board the vessel include some 2,600 medical devices. Patients could even consult Chinese medicine practitioners there. Some hospitals uh, don't have some uh, technology, especially for the surgeon. I think this uh, both hospital help the uh, Madagascar. More than 40 types of surgeries can be performed on board the Peace Ark, and residents often travel hours to seek medical help. Timothy Lee, TV News.